Hey, uh, how's everybody doing? This is unfortunately another one of not those happy, great videos as it is on the AHL deciding to postpone some more games as the Wolves and Monsters games postponed. The American Hockey League yesterday announced that due to the league-wide COVID-19 protocols affecting the Chicago Wolves, their game scheduled for Wednesday the 22nd and Thursday the 23rd at Cleveland have been postponed. Um, and then also in more postponements, the American Hockey League um, a day ago yesterday as well announced that due to league COVID-19 protocols affecting the Wolfsbury Scranton Penguins, Syracuse Crunch, Bellevue Senators, and Toronto Morleys, the following games have been postponed. Wednesday the 22nd, Wilkesbury Scranton at Rochester. Um, Wednesday the 22nd, Providence at Syracuse. And Thursday or Tuesday, December 28th, excuse me, Syracuse at Belleville, and then Tuesday, December 28th, Providence at Toronto. So they're postponing some games after the break already as well as a, a, an overabundance of caution, I guess. Uh, the Penguins, Crutch Senators, and Morley's organizations continue to follow enhanced protocols at the direction of team medical staff and the AHL. And then on top of them, the American Hockey League uh, announced that the game between the Ontario Reign and and the Henderson Silver Knights will not take place this evening, Wednesday, December 22nd, either. And in even more damning news, for the second year in a row, the AHL is not going to have their great to show off the stars of the league. All-Star Classic is two hours ago to the time now. The American Hockey League President and CEO Scott Hawson announced that due to the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, the 2022 All-Star Classic scheduled for February 6th and 7th in Laval, Quebec, will not be held. It'll be interesting to see if the ECHL is still able to do their All-Star tilts uh, because they were going to broadcast that on NHL Network, so it would be a damn shame if the AA League, the ECHL, isn't able to do it since they were going to get national recognition for whoever does have NHL Network at least. But the quotes talked about here is the Laval Rocket and Place Bell have done an outstanding job preparing to host our All-Star Classic festivities this year. But with the event only six weeks away and faced with ongoing challenges pertaining to health and safety, international travel, and group gatherings, the league and the Rocket organization feel it is in everybody's best interest to postpone this event. We remain continue to bring in an All-Star Classic to the Vol in the future. Postponing the All-Star Classic for a second year in a row is disappointed, but unfortunately un avoidable in the circumstances, said France Margaret Belanger, President of Sports and Entertainment at Group CH. This is one of the most prestigious events in the AHL, and we look forward to hosting this major event at Place Bell. We are grateful to our fans and partners for their loyalty during this difficult time. We also want to thank the American Hockey League for their confidence and collaboration on this project. So unfortunately, there is more games postponed in the American Hockey League and the All-Star Classic that is one of the more fun uh, things to obviously watch and see showcased all the studs of the game together is unfortunately postponed for now two years in a row, but at least the AHL, like I gave some positive solace when the NHL committed not going to the Olympics uh, officially today, at least they committed to saying they're looking forward to the next one. At least the AHL committed to saying they're looking forward to bringing it to Laval in the future. So at least that's a positive in all this negative with all the games getting affected by COVID. But I hope everybody stays safe out there, has a good holiday season. As you can see, the Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree in the background. Merry Christmas, everybody. A happy holiday. Stay safe out there and enjoy the hockey that is on as we look forward to hopefully having things straying out in the new year but also just having the rest of the season, and they will use, I'm assuming, those two days of the 6th and the 7th, since obviously teams would have been off to make up some of these postponed games as well. But have a safe and pleasant day, everybody, and enjoy the hockey. Peace out, everybody, and have a good holiday season.